it shocked me we like say tear gas actually causes tears <sighs> so as you can see we are the only i'm the only one here see the so um the police there those are the protesters i refuse to go back because what did we do wrong i didn't do anything wrong we had the, the, the protesters yeah so please and i don't blame the police because they follow orders please this is what causes chaos when they are protesting when you try to stop the act so please let us continue working people of zamfara we are here for you people of kasina people that are hungry people in Lagos, people in benway i especially have the people of zamfara and kasina at heart i don't know anybody in zamfara but so but I have them hard because they are constantly being killed and no one is doing anything about it. I'm surprised that the government has so much um, police and street operators, but they refuse to deploy them to, to where they are actually needed. Good day now, my people. Welcome back. This is your boy, the Adam Slink. I also that day. Okay, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. Well, I saw some of your comments now. You were asking, Adam Slink, where you day? You did day says to do they make video while does they protest? Let me be honest with you guys. Huh? Studio eh, is different from my own personal civil rights. You understand? And again, I show my face for social media, so I'm easily targeted. So if I go, if anywhere I go that uh, protest yesterday, I will never post it. Never. If you want to know if I go to that protest, eh, go and ask local man. Or you ask a free, a, a free West Deep. Or other my brothers who are close to me, my brothers, or people who were really who are really really close to me, who I know say, eh, we can do such thing together. That is who you are gonna ask. Or if you if you they personal to me, really really close to me, and I trust you, then you will know if I go there or not. So don't be waiting. I'll go post for you. Say I go, I go, I go because that is my civil right, and this is my business. Now, it's what I do. It's what I love doing. So, they are separate. So, you have to differentiate them. I know they can't chase clouds. See how they show, show, oh, go, go. Nah, I will never post that such, such thing here. Never. Well, that being said, this time, boy, again, Adam Slink. Let us go through some major things that happened yesterday. Of course, you saw that woman who was tear gas uh, uh, the other uh, yesterday and uh, giving and who ordained. My own crazy thought about this whole thing is celebrities talking. Let us talk about the celebrities. Firstly, we, we saw how uh, Regina Daniels was giving her own advices online to the protesters. Let's listen to our guys. Good afternoon, good evening, whenever you're seeing this video, and a happy new month to everyone. Today is August 1st, which is the one of the national protests in Nigeria. We all know that the masses are suffering. We all know that the masses want a better way of living. Hence the protests. And there is nothing wrong in protesting. Absolutely nothing wrong in wanting a change or a better way of living. There is nothing wrong in airing your voices. But there is everything wrong in violence. Once violence gets involved, it defeats the whole purpose of a protest. So please, I urge everyone to try and make this protest as peaceful as possible so that the voice of the masses will be heard and actions will be taken on it and everyone will return to their homes in one piece. We have seen series of violent protests. We know how it all went. All we can hope and pray for is that this protest goes differently and still your voices will be heard and actions will be taken on it. Once again, this is a call for a peaceful protest. Thank you. Well, that is coming from... Uh... Regina Daniels, and uh, obviously you can see she actually gave a really nice advice. So I have nothing, nothing, nothing personal against her at all. She really gave a nice advice, and of course it's because of the situation of the country that is why you see some people uh, they marry other people, which is nothing wrong. Wrong. I don't see nothing wrong with that because I'm a Muslim, and uh, as long as you are up to the age, you are free to marry whoever you want to marry. But when you start seeing people now commenting, someone said. If country good, you go marry your grandpapa. Come on, man. That was harsh. Then this guy said, talk to your husband first. He's part of the bad governance. 
come on, man. She is just trying to give her own little support to you guys for peaceful protests. And let's be honest, none of us want this protest to go south at all. None of us. Let's be honest, guys. None of us want this protest to go south. But then again, this is not the question me and they always like ask. Do you think the federal government will listen to peaceful dialogue? Because over the years, people have been talking and talking and talking and talking and talking and talking and talk, 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 We are still where we are. We are still where we are. The only thing I do not like about peace violence is that waiting a traffic light do you. <laughs> Waity Pessy, you got store. Do you? Waity Pessy, personal business of rice made they sell. Do you? Waity Pessy, shop. Do you? That is pure criminality. Let us remove protests from criminality. And we have some city people who are sponsoring this protest. In fact, we get us a they have located, tracked down a senator who is sponsoring a uh, violent protest. Why don't you get this guy arrested? This is exactly the good governance that people are asking for. You, have, you know who is causing havoc. Because of the bad government, you guys will not get those people arrested and get them prosecuted and make sure you are jailed. Exactly what people are asking for you are still sharing it to our face that you cannot do it. You people start making all trances like be one, this and that. <laughs> Government officials, they make they boast. Why are you boosting? It's crazy though, it's really, really crazy. And again, let's uh, check uh, Yabo Joe. This is why I also do not blame some people eh, who refuse to speak on this particular protest matter. Because uh, Nigerians no good for mouth. Iyabo just said, Please, sir, kindly speak to your men to caution their men. Allow a peaceful protest. Peaceful protest is their right. That is what Iyabo Ojo wrote. And if you see comment of insult, Oh God, Nigeria said they are savage. Someone said, failed address, address, jumping from one man to another. Seriously, she can't give her daughter a good advice. Well, her daughter is following her one man to another, band full step. Can you imagine? And this person, eh? eh? This person is not. I know evil things say evil day Nigeria self. Or evil evil do a day Nigeria is not part of the protest. It's not even in Nigeria, this person. Or a day Nigeria, but you know they would they do part of the protest. Then another person, Yabo Ojo, is an unrepre unrepentant Confucianist. And I am applauded to a gutter and illiterate behavior. How can a mother carry an infant to a protest ground for crying out loud. That aside, government was very clear to protesters on the on, on the usage of MKO Abiola st uh, Stadium. What exactly was the woman doing at Eagle Square? The thing is that this woman, even though they can't go to another place, there is a way to handle matter. And Nigerians, eh? Do not, do not they look for every opportunity to shift their attention. To shift their attention. I just want to apply, I, I just want to make a statement to all those uh, celebrities, eh? Don't mind if you have a genuine heart or genuine heart towards the protest. Just give the little you can give and eh? don't mind the insult from people. Because Nigeria is a very dynamic uh, country. 
and people have their own different way of thinking, how they view things, and how they see things. You see somebody with support portable that is constantly causing you, and meanwhile, someone is fighting for your civil rights, you now go to insult them. Like Nance Boy said, me protest, L O L. The last time I spoke up, them used threatening won't finish my life. I came to I, I called Twitter, come post the DM of threat, and I love people, they love me. A lot of celebrities don't get money of politics, politics like you insinuate, but now just fear of being a scapegoat. See, just keep quiet, you understand? Nice boy, eh? if you have nothing to, so, like to show solidarity, keep quiet, you understand? Just relax yourself. Don't bring your past things, come. Don't toss it, you protest. No, just keep your mouth shut. For crying out loud. Keep quiet. Just keep quiet. Don't say nothing. Now, if you bring this one, as you bring this one, people can't shift their attention. Now face you. Just keep quiet. The protest was still going on and uh, I saw some cra really, really crazy videos. So, and I do not want to think all those guys are protesters. Maybe they are more the violent part. But then again, if you see someone who has never known no education, government never empower her one day, nobody empower like free education, make sure that person goes to school. How will that person know the difference between peaceful uh, protests and a uh, violent protest? You know, they go television, they shout peaceful violence, peaceful violence, peaceful violence. Meanwhile, half of the people you people are talking to are not even educated to know the meaning of peaceful and violence because your government failed to educate your citizens and then you they come station go they talk peaceful violence not peaceful violence how would you understand they know the year you cannot communicate on it oh come on god, god damn it this one has simple something this is something that i've eaten into our system obviously you now to say this is a new system good and fine we know this is a new system but then again, why are you do why are you not doing something differently from the other uh, uh, from the whole system? At least do something differently now. Dialogue well, interact well. Don't come using force by force by force by force by force by force. No to violence protests, guys. No to violence protests. But I think the government needs to still do more. Understand. I think the government they have they need to do more. Hmm? More. They need to do more, guys. Well, today is Friday, and we are still going to be monitoring the protest. And we also commend some police people, some police who were who were doing some uh, civil rights, sharing pure water. Sharing relief material, assisting protesters. You understand? Eh? We also saw how some police, how some police work diligently to make sure nobody ejected uh, any of their protests they are monitoring. Meanwhile, some other places you see a protest scatter. Sometimes I don't really blame the police as well because me as a police uniform, you just following order, and I hear person throws to hit my head. I go verse. I go verse. With a style go verse. You understand? And meanwhile, well, let's see, guys. So catch you next time. Peace.